Hello everybody and welcome, my name is Eric and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to change your spark plug or spark plugs on your Tohatsu Mariner uh, what's the other one, the 6.5 horsepower 4 stroke from Hankai, the Chinese uh, clone Mariner, Mercury as well so, uh, this video comes to you as a request from a viewer today actually, he asked me if, um, if I could show him how to change a spark plug and it's fairly easy First, we're going to remove the cowling out of your outboard. Now, I'm going to, let me zoom in and show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. Let me go ahead and uh, put it a little bit close. Now, usually when you open the cowling, you guys are going to see a wire like this. See how it looks? And when you unplug it, literally, just push it out. It exposes the spark plug. Now, you're going to need... A 5.8 five um, ratchet sprocket, more or less, ratchet, <laughs> and we're going to go ahead and remove that. Pretty simple, fairly easy. Shouldn't be too tight. Sorry for the shakiness of the camera. This is like an impromptu video and a rather simple one, honestly. So I didn't take time. To make anything too professional <laughs> if it makes any sense now for replacement you guys are going to need an ngk 3481 dcpr 6e this one they come pre-gapped so you don't have to gap them however if you want to know the gap it is actually 0 0.03 of an inch of a gap if you ever need that number now you know it however when you purchase these like I mentioned, they come pre-gapped. They remove it out of the darn box if it wants to come out. Son of a gun, get it out of the box. Heavens above. Comes like this inside from the box. Remove that, that's to protect the gap. See, it's already pre-gapped pretty nicely. And uh, we're gonna put the new spark plug in its place. Well, I'm sure there's a specific spark specification for the um what's the word for the torque but in reality when you're gonna get it tightened just tighten you know like by hand just snug now about that's good enough see it doesn't require it a whole lot you're gonna put in the uh the coal wire on it make sure it's real snug put in the cowling and that's it fairly easy a piece of cake thanks for watching Hee <laughs>